folded it over in a vise carefully, and you can see you can make your own tips. So if you guys are serious about learning uh, different soldering methods, this is something you can do yourself. You can see the lights come on and this unit is highly uh, ready to go as far as being active right now. So what I'm gonna do is take the Kesta 186 flux, you can do the same thing, we're gonna saturate this. Then I'm gonna drop beads on both ends. So you can see we've got a pocket here. We're just gonna hit this carefully, let it just fill, okay? Once it starts dripping over onto my mat, I know I'm golden, I'm saturated, and I'm ready to go. Now I just need proper heat. Now I cut the piece of solder, this is Kester number 44, and I cut this approximately six to eight inches, and what I'll do is I'll feed this so that I'll get the proper beating. And what's gonna happen, because I'm using the proper flux, is you'll see that solder go in, and as the heat penetrates, you'll see the wicking action where it'll just level. So first side I'm gonna hit is this side, and I don't know if she can get that so easy. I'll let her get the position. And what I'm gonna do is take the iron and just heat right here and put it right in that groove. You can hear it, and now we're just filling. Let that heat up, and I'm just gonna stop filling for a second. Now I'll fill again. Let this go. What you're gonna see is that solder will wick itself right in as it gets hot enough and it will penetrate. There we go. Just holding the iron there, no pressure. Okay, and there you go. You can see right here that is perfectly filled. We'll let it cool for a second.